Welcome to a new FAQ video about new features of Relux Cut for Revit. At the end of March 2022, Relux has launched a new version of Relux Cut for Revit. To learn more about the new features, five descriptions along with tutorial and images have been added to the What is new in Relux Cut for Revit page. In this video, we will once again show you the different new features and in a second step answer the most frequently asked questions we have received so far. Let's go! New feature, performance improvement. With the latest update of Relix CAD for Revit, the performance of the software has been significantly improved to save even more time when planning lighting in Revit. For direct comparison, a floor with 31 rooms was calculated in the previous version and the latest version of Relix CAD for Revit, during which the time was measured. In this test, a usage profile was assigned to the rooms and the number of luminaires for each of the 31 rooms was calculated in the room manager. In general, it can be said that the larger the project and the more rooms it contains, the more time will be effectively saved with the latest update. In a second part, as in a real project, a room was modified using the Easy Lux tool. The existing luminaire was replaced with a new type of luminaire and the room was recalculated. While the new version of Relix CAD for Revit calculated the test scenario in just over 3 minutes 20 seconds, the previous version still calculates the first part of the test. Multiple representative tests have shown that the latest improvements have accelerated work in Relix CAD for Revit by 40 to 90%, compared to the previous version. Will Revit also work faster with the update? Unfortunately not. The latest performance improvement of Relux Cut for Revit affects only our add-on, not Revit itself. What options do I have to further improve the performance? Yes, there are some options to even improve the performance of Relux Cut for Revit further. So for example, if you open the room manager, usually it won't take long until it's open. But here I have two options, auto collect luminous and auto collect materials. And if these options are selected, the room manager will search for the exact material and uh, will verify if there are already some luminaires inserted in the rooms and this process of searching and verifying if these uh, information are already available will make that the room manager takes much longer to open. Therefore deselect those two options and you can be sure that the room manager is available very quickly. New feature, task areas. In addition to a measuring surface, the surrounding areas can also be calculated. Why is it not possible to enter new values? So you might wondering why it's not possible to modify the 
face offset or surrounding in millimeter of this pick face tool. So if I would like to add a measuring surface on this table, for example, um, here I have per default five millimeter offset from the table and a surrounding around the table of 500 millimeters. If I would like to change that, I need to press enter. So it's written here, but I make, I have to make sure to do that. So I enter 200 and now I click on enter and this way it works. If I only enter 500 and I, yeah, I leave this uh, box, it will remain 200. So make sure you click on enter as soon as you entered the value. How does the volume computation affect the calculation? This question refers to a message that comes up as soon as you calculate a room. So here, compute vol volumes to increase accuracy, the calculation of room volume should be activated. So what does that mean? I will cancel this calculation and under entry level give you a quick overview on what we are talking about. So here for example for this first floor we have this room geometry that should go just to the uh, top of the ceiling and so if we do not activate this option the relux cut for Revit will calculate only the room geometry as you can see it now so it's uh, basically a box so but if we activate the the volume of it it will work in a different way i will show you that based on this uh, floor so here on the architecture room area and area and volume computation, you can choose between areas or areas and volumes. So it's faster to create only these areas. So in this, for example, just the box or the whole areas and volumes. If we do that, you then can see that we take into the account the whole geometry of the room. This is more accurate, and but it takes a little bit longer to calculate. New feature, false color diagram. Measuring surfaces can be extended to display false color results more accurately. Does the option high resolution false colors only have an effect on the visualization? Good question. Since the last update, we have a new option under Luminaire. It's called high resolution false colors. This means if we select this option, that we will run our calculation with more measuring points and this affects also the false color uh, view. So for example, if I run the calculation again, we will then have, uh, it takes a little bit longer, but we will then have um, a result that is more accurate and we will have another, um, an another uh, false color overview. It's slightly different. Take a look at this. New feature, complex luminaires. Support for custom luminaires containing joints or multiple light sources.
What options for complex custom luminaires are now supported? So for complex luminaire not coming from Relux.net, you can now have um, a, uh, LDCs that are not located in the center of a luminaire or you can have you can build now a luminaire with more than one LDC as you can see it here and a uh, third option the luminaires joints can point uh, in different direction this was also not possible in the previous versions of Relux Cut for Revit New feature, export functions. The latest version of Relix CAD for Revit has a brand new export option that makes it easy to export only the required elements of the Revit model to Relix desktop. By opening the settings, visibility, graphics overrides, an overview of all layers of the model is displayed. All layers of the model that are not needed for the current work process, or that are not to be exported to Relix desktop can be hidden here. These changes have an immediate effect on the current view. To hide individual elements, the desired object can be selected, and a right click will give the option to hide that specific element. In this way, however, entire categories can also be hidden, similar to the layer list. As soon as only the elements required for the export are visible in the current view, the export dialog can be opened. For the export of an outdoor scene, the rooms are not required, but the folder directory must be specified. In the lower part of the dialog, the option, exterior scene must be selected, before the new function, only visible elements in the current view can be activated. The export of the visible model is exported directly to Relix desktop and the scene opens automatically. The building in Relix Desktop contains the elements selected in Revit, and impresses with a high level of detail. How can the section box be used for export? Thank you for these very important questions. Since this function was only mentioned in the descriptions of this new feature, but not in the tutorial. Therefore, I will show it now. So, first of all, we have to activate the section box. Here, I click on this bulb, and then I click my right click on the section uh, box and click on Unhide in View Elements. Now, the section box is also available in this 3D view. Here we minimize the view of this scene, for example like this. And perhaps even a little bit more. And now in this section box, only this part of the whole building is now displayed. And when I export this little part to Relux Desktop, here it's important to um, click on exterior scene and also here on only section box, then on export. And now we can see we have only this little section of the whole building that was ex exported to Relux desktop. These were the most important questions about the features of the new version of Relux Cut for Revit. 
Remember that the add-on can be downloaded from our website and used free of charge for 30 days. Do you have more questions about the add-on and its new features? Leave a comment below so we can answer your questions too. Thanks for watching and have fun with our software.